Hi, Randy Fairfield here, Mr. Ed Tech, and today I'd like to share with you one way that you can use Edmodo and Google Docs to really help improve upon the writing process as well as your method of giving feedback to students. Have any of you ever been in a situation as a teacher where you've worked really hard to give students meaningful feedback on an essay that they've turned in uh, via paper and pencil, and you, you give it back to them, they look at the grade and toss it in the trash can? Uh, this happened quite a bit for me when I first started teaching, but I found that students really responded well to the digital feedback that I gave to them on Edmodo. And I also found that using Google Docs to give them real-time feedback as they worked and before they turned in their finished product was incredibly valuable to them uh, as far as really helping them master the skills that we focused in on during the writing assignment. So here's how I went about using Edmodo and Google Docs to give students really meaningful feedback. So you can see here I've got this five paragraph essay posted up as an assignment to my test group uh, for which I put my son in here. And you'll see the directions for the five paragraph essay here along with a little note on the bottom. And the note says, as soon as you see this assignment post, please leave an assignment comment that has a link to the Google Doc you will be using to write your essay. This will help me track your progress and give you supportive feedback as you work. And again, I love using Edmodo and Google Docs to really support students and help them out and achieve mastery rather than you know, hammer them uh, when they get something wrong. The assignment comment feature in Edmodo really allows you to go back and forth with students until they get it. And Google Docs really helps facilitate some of that feedback as well. So I would actually show the students what I would want them to do here. So in this case, if the student from here clicks Turn In on Edmodo, I'm not ready for them to actually turn the assignment in. So I'm going to just leave this, have them leave this blank. But down here it says click here to send a comment to your teacher. I would want them to click there and as a comment say here is my essay or here is the progress on my essay or whatever the case might be and from here they can go to their backpack go to their linked Google Drive if they've set that up and then give me the blank Google Doc that they've already started for this five paragraph essay assignment if they haven't connected with the Google Drive yet they can still turn in uh, a link to their Google Doc right here and that would work as well. So either one of those ways I teach students as a way for them to show me the work that they're doing up on Google Drive with the docs, slides, and sheets and whatever else they might be creating there. Uh, any files that they put on Google Drive you've got to show them how to share those with you. So two different methods there. So let's just say this was the Google Doc that they'd started blah 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 blah. As a teacher, once they send me this link through the backpack or on Edmodo sending me the, the hyperlink to click on, from there I can give them all kinds of great feedback in real time. As they're working on this assignment and typing, I could jump in to the Edmodo assignment where it's been where they've sent me that assignment comment, click on the link and give them feedback in real time. It's really neat. I can also give them comments here and say something along the lines of capitalize or I could give them a lot deeper feedback as well. So this is really really neat and they can see this in real time. Besides that there's also a number of add-ons which I'm not going to cover today uh, that can really be great as far as giving students uh, voice feedback. Kaizena is one of them where you just quickly speak into the microphone and can give them some audio feedback on their writing. And there's all kinds of other neat tools here, um, add-ons here in Google Docs that students can use to really help them with writing as well. And then you can have comments uh, back and forth here with the students uh, on the assignment comments on Edmodo once the thing's already been turned in to give them back and forth as well. So using both the Edmodo assignment comments, the comments here on the Google Docs, as well as some of these add-ons. Uh, to really give the students meaningful feedback, I promise you they're going to respond so much better to the feedback that you give them in this way 
because it's in a way that really speaks their language. Go with them back and forth, give them meaningful feedback, and help them achieve mastery rather than just focusing on the deadline and saying you're done. Hope this video helps and that you have a great day. Take care.